سبحانك يا رحمن تعاليت يا رحيم أجرنا من النار بعفوك يا رحمن The power of Bismillah Now, as Muslims, we want safety physically, right? For ourselves, our own life. Your life is very dear to you. After that, you want safety for your family, your spouse, your children, your parents, your siblings. But most importantly, you want safety in deen. You don't want your religion, you don't want your faith to be compromised in any way. You lose your life, yes, you lose an opportunity to earn more reward, but you go into the year after, right? You lose your wealth, it's something for which you can compensate. You lose someone close to you, you lose a spouse, you can get married again. But if you lose your faith and you don't regain it before demise, it's catastrophic in terms of your eternal success in terms of your eligibility for entry into Jannah. Now, there are various things that we need to do, and there are various things that we should abstain from in order to protect our lives, to protect the lives of our family, and to protect our faith and our religion and our deen together with that of our family members. Here we are taught in our deen a supplication, which the scholars say we must read three times in the morning after Fajr Salah and three times in the, morning after, in the evening after Maghrib. So you get protection for the day by reading it three times in the morning, and protection for the night by reading it three times in the evening. What is the dua? Bismillahi ala dini wa nafsi wa waladi wa ahli wa mali. It means, with the name of Allah, do I seek the protection of Allah in my deen. Most important is my religion. My faith must not be compromised. In my life, my own life, my children, they must be protected in every sense. My spouse, he or she must be protected and my belongings. One sentence, but look at how comprehensive. Bismillahi ala dini wa nafsi wa ahli wa waladi wa mali. Learn this dua, teach it to your kids, teach it to small children, and make a habit of reciting it. What's its part of your routine? Three times in the morning after Fajr, three times in the evening after Maghrib, then you tap into the power of Bismillah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. أيت يا رحيم أجرنا من النار بعفوك يا رحمة